Okay. After a long layoff, we are back. We've no had, more COVID. We had some sickness running through the house at times. Danny is healthy and he's back in his normal dirty white t-shirt. And underwear. Blake is here. Hi. The Lions have won on Saturday Night Football, if that's a thing. Is that a real thing, Saturday Night Football? Not really. Now it is. National TV, Saturday night. And we are here with some new chips. Pockies. Jalapeno Tropicale. Jalapeno Tropicale. Pocky. We know the Pockies brand is usually pretty hot. This one is just hot. Scale says hot. The first one we tried was um freaking hot. And, yeah. And then, the, and then we tried kind of hot last time. Yeah, so I don't know. We'll see what this is all about. But uh, a little more of a tortilla chip, I guess. Um, anyways, the Pocky brand out of, uh, drawing a blank, Austin, Texas. Out of Austin, Texas. So we'll see. All right. Hmm. Danny's still making weird noises, I can see. Like a regular just tortilla chip. I, I don't agree. really get the smell. I don't really get too much jalapeno. Pretty normal, pretty normal tortilla chip smell. One chip, everybody knows the rules. Hope it doesn't taste like regular tortilla chip. I mean, kind of expecting more of it. Like stops. Stop I like to smash it. I like it though, but I'm just let it smash. So, my initial thought is that I don't know if we should judge this like a normal tortilla chip, or if we should judge it like a potato chip, or if we, we should judge, judge it. Like, we judge it like a normal chip. Like or if we should judge it based on the Pocky brand, which tends to be a little spicier. All right. Hi. So my first thought on this is that it's more of a tortilla chip, not a potato chip. Because... No, really. All right, let him finish. Can I please finish? Yes. It is a tortilla chip. Like. Yeah. Huh. It, this is definitely a tortilla chip. Why did I blame? Tortilla chip. Because there's no potato in this. So, I don't know why they're promoting it as a potato chip, I feel like. I feel like they're kind of promoting it as a potato chip, but that's okay. This chip isn't bad, but the only really flavor, I get the jalapeno flavor, and I get a little bit of hotness. But besides that, that's really the only flavor. It's not a bad flavor, but it's a little bit just not there. It's just kind of like, it's just a, like... It's just not uh, like there to me. I don't know. It's got a little kick. A little kick. Danny, thoughts? Oh, I tried. I mean, had higher expectations for this chip, in my opinion, but I I like it. I would eat it, but I'm going to rank it kind of lower. I, I So let's it, keep in mind before we grade this. If you consider an average tortilla chip to be a five, how would you grade this? That's kind of what we have to keep in mind, I think. I wouldn't give the... No, actually, I would. i give it exactly a 7. Okay. Okay. What's keeping it from being higher than a 7? Not much flavor, in my opinion. I think it's sort of bland, but I kind of like the flavor that's there. Okay. Blake? Sorry. Do you need so, to give it a 7? What do you think? I'm going to go a little bit higher than him. 7-2. Okay. Bad. Anything before we move on? What's keeping it from being higher than a seven two for you? The only flavor I get is jalapeno. I just wish there was a little bit more different flavors. Like it's kind of just one flavor, and it doesn't blow my mind. Okay. Well. I don't know. I think these guys are pretty much right. I don't. I don't know if they completely communicated why, but I think this has to be judged as a tortilla chip. It's got a little bit of a kick. It doesn't have a lot of. Will you dance? You're like dancing. 
Blake, please. Sorry, but he's acting. It's got a little bit of a kick. Um, I think I think it's maybe a little disappointing because the Pocky brand is supposed to be like really a huge kick and it's not quite there. I mean, but, chips are. Um, but I, th I think it's all right. I think these guys were really pretty close with their grading. I think it's better than an average tortilla chip. So I think we have to keep that in mind. It's tastier than an average tortilla chip. So I'll go... Seven three. I mean, I think we're we're all within point point three of each other. What would you give it? Seven seven seven. Seven, and you said seven two, two. and I said seven three. I mean, we're all really close. Mm -hmm. I don't know if we all gave the same explanation or not, but it's better than a normal tortilla chip. It's got more flavor than a normal tortilla chip. It's got a little bit of a kick to it. It's just not mm -hmm. that great. So that's where we're at. I don't know. It's got some jalapeno flavor, like it said. Um, it's got a little bit of a sweetness, like it says. That's what the tropical part comes from. It's got a little bit of a uh, um, a pineapple-ish flavor, a sweetness. Um, and it's there. It's just not that great. So, 7-3 for me. All right. Anything else to say? Go Lions. Lions over Broncos. Water Ly bottle. Lions one win from the division championship. Yep. The first division which championship I, which, since when? Since when? 1997. 93. Oh, 93. Even further. 93. Sorry. When I was 12 years old, January of 90. Oh, wait, no. That's not right. It would be January of 94. I'm 13 years old. So it was the 93 season, but 94 is when it got clinched. So I would have been 13, actually. And I'm obviously much older than that now. A ridiculous amount of time. Ridiculous amount of time. Danny, anything else to say? Uh, the Lions have won the same amount of playoff games as the Texans, and the Texans has only, have only existed since the 90s. Yes, and both are really bad, in yeah. quite bad shape. But anyhow. Not this season. This year is this year. All right, go Lions. Bye.